Welcome, this is Glendon the Pack Rat, and I mean Dishonored, and this is episode 6. Now, I figured out, I went back to the workshop and grabbed the wheel, and that's about the only thing I've done since the last episode. I just looked around to make sure I didn't miss anything, um, and I found a note attached over here that a wheel opens this door, it was right on top of that, and uh, yeah, the wheel opens the door. So I can get the break the the yeah the damn bone charm. So yeah. I almost didn't get that. The bone charm. Give me that. Take that. Read the book. Did I say this is episode six? Collecting information. Wait, I just saw something. Did I not see something? Uh. How am I going to get out of here? Are you telling me I could have broke this and got in from here? I guess I'm going to Samuel now. <laughs> Can't jump up there, at least not like that. Hmm. Well, um, yeah, I'm not going anywhere here. And I can't open that from the outside. Oh, I got more stuff. I don't care about that. And I can't get out, except for jumping out here. So, well, I've just thoroughly screwed myself. Um, can I go that far without dying? I could hit the water. <gasps> I can swim in all this grody water with stuff in it. You, I can swim, but can I get back out? I know, um, I'm probably not done yet. I think I am done. I got a little bone charge. Let me just double check. I can feel the age ending. And, uh, yeah, we're done here. Um, we're back up to six and six crossbows. I did find it a lot. We're almost uh, down on bullets. Um, dark vision. It seems that if I wait for a while, I actually get, oh, there's fish in there. I actually get... Wow. Um, that's pretty freaky. Th that That's just freaky. Let's just wait till it ends. Okay, he looks a little better now. <laughs> Alright, Samuel. Samuel. A pretty posh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. Are you ready to go? Um, that would be a yes. Business okay, is finished. Go. Although I probably missed something somewhere. Could it be entire loot rooms I missed for all I know? Chaos killed high. Yeah. Hostiles killed 45. Mm, saves the sparrow. Okay, we're good. Um, coins found, but I, there was more coins to find. Oh, man. I didn't know I could find outside outsider shrines. I didn't know there was any of those either. Ah, two of, only two of five. Oh, my God. Runes found. Ah. Well, I guess you can replay missions. Okay, we have made it back. I think. He's alive. Thank you, Corvo. Thank you. My uncle's a good man, and one day he'll prove it. Here. I know you did this for the right reasons, but I want you to take this as a reward. It's an old heirloom one of my aunts gave me. What the hell am I supposed to do with that? Other than sell it. Wow. Take 
take down the Lord region. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta work on you first. Sailors tell tales of monsters far out to sea. But I'll tell you, there's strange things in this river no one talks about. No, you're the one I gotta see. Can I be of service to you? Maybe. Yes. Now, I bought a good 20 bolts the other time I was here. And when I started the mission, I had nine. And I don't know what the hell happened to them all. Um, just going to resupply and make sure I have everything I need. Uh, grenades, don't really use them, but I can find them, right? A rewire tool. I don't actually use, didn't ever use one of those yet. I can buy runes from this guy for 500? What? Are you kidding me? Upgrade. I should have upgraded. Instead of buying all that crap, I should have upgraded. Let's go ahead and back up the save then. I'm going to pause it and I'm going to upgrade instead of buying all that crap. Okay, I reloaded the game just to get the upgrades because I forgot completely about those. Crossbow accuracy. Let's do that. Crossbow reload. Makes it faster. Um, That's 600. Crossbow range. Mask optic, bullet capacity, bolt capacity. Mm. Bone charm capacity? Huh. I want to do a bolt capacity again, because if I find bolts, then I can't pick them up. All right, we just upgraded the shit out of bullet capacity. That could be, that could be useful too. Yeah. Okay. Now purchases. Do I have? Let's uh, go ahead and get me some crossbow bolts, and that's all I can. Yeah, that's all I can do right now. But that's good. Let's uh, do a quick save so I don't ruin what I just did. And let's go talk to the uh, loyalist over here. I'd imagine the daughter of an empress is tougher than you think. Hmm. Quite right. In any case, you did it. Somehow yep, I did. Do I get my beer now? I knew you were our man. With Campbell gone, we've hurt the Lord Regent immeasurably. And with Martin back, we'll have the finest strategist alive. The Lord Regent must be shitting himself in Dunwall Tower. Yes. And Campbell's journal, let's not forget. Our hope is that in these encoded pages, the location and condition of Emily Caldwin can be discovered. Our entire movement will mean nothing if we can't place the rightful heir on the throne. We must act fast. No doubt the Lord Regent is holding Emily somewhere, waiting to reveal her, to step out as the hero and further cement her agency. If he doesn't bring the young lady forth soon, there will be infighting among the nobles as to who should succeed the Empress. The hell do you shoot that? Oh. Yes, time is against us. But now you should take a well-earned rest, Corvo. We will decipher the contents of the High Overseer's journal and share them with you later. Okay. I never actually make it to the bed. I just wind up getting up from it all the time. And we're good. Let's see the Admiral. Treasonous speech and actions. Hmm. Just wanted to see what's out here. Because it is a way into my bedroom, you know. Straight into my bedroom.
Oh, there's something left on the floor. Oh, man. At least I got a dry place to sleep with no rats. I mean, that's good. Be nibbling on your toes and shit while you're sleeping. I am on the roof, though. Which is, I guess, a good place to get away from everything. Yeah. You're lucky I keep you on. Lucky? This place would fall. Hard than ten minutes without me. Is that so? Don't let me disturb you. In any case, you can't dismiss me. I went through the books this morning and found five mistakes you've made. Very well. You're lucky I found them before the Admiral did. I'm sort of completely lost here. <laughs> if I had actually gone up to my bedroom, I would have uh, been able to find the damn shit and know how to get back out. He's not in there in the, having a beer. Hmm. kind of thought he'd be in there having a beer. I still left the glass on the floor. Admiral Havelock. He's out here somewhere. Then it says he's in there. He's out here. He's in there. He's out here. He's out here. What are you chuckleheads doing now? What? I didn't Hello, do it. Corporal. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. I hate oh, really? to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Most likely a weeper. The uh oh. Bastard. There's Tell no her the Weeper. The plague gets that far along. Nothing more than a shuffling corpse full of sickness and insects, if you ask me. I'd appreciate you investigating, just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. Yuck. I'd send a servant down there, but they'd die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that route. Um, let's, uh, since I just picked up some coinage, see if I can get a few more crossbow bolts before I go down there. I know the Golden Cat, not as a patron, mind you. I designed some specialized devices for... Okay, oh, my talk friend. to her later. Do you need ammunition? Uh, maybe a few crossbow like bolts, yes. Have something for you? Because I'm going to go shoot some shit. What you got? What? 18 coins cost 20. <laughs> I picked up some coins, but yeah, it's not going to happen. I need more coins. You think these guys would outfit me a little more, but I got 18 bolts and that's good. Okay. Open the sewers. Hmm. Oh, first of all, Let's use some sight. So let's see what we're doing here. And then let's use some. We don't have any bullets. Apparently, what's it? Oh. Hmm. Remember, this is a game that hides things everywhere. What the hell? Oh, this goes out with fishes. No, I don't want to go out there. I didn't figure I was going to swim either. In the sewer. I'm swimming in a freaking sewer. I'm going to need a bath after this. Ooh, we have stuff. Be quiet. Don't to make no. Is this back upstairs? In the tavern directly? Are you kidding me? You have everything locked up, but here you have it open. And a way to climb up. Uh, 
How about go through the door first and close it? Hmm. We're in the sewers. Hey, 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 hey! Ancient no. Hmm. <gasps> it's a rune. Press J to acquire powers. Powers. I have two runes. Um, I really need to increase that vitality too, but let's upgrade the, yeah, let's upgrade the night vision because I'm going to be using that the most. It lets me see a lot of stuff. And I've read that you really do want to upgrade the shit out of that. It's another rune something else and there's a lot of stuff in this game you can't even find without that see I would never have found these now it's upgraded so I can see loot and stuff right wish I could have the crossbow in one hand uh, look at that hmm must be where it came in but it wasn't it's not where I came in. Huh. Well, if that's all that was down here, that's pretty cool. I mean, it, it got me a rune. Got me an upgrade. Couple of weavers. That's all we had to do, right? Unless there's something out here I can do. There's fish out here. Hold and crank the wheel. I scared the shit out of Samuel. <laughs> Shall we go fishing? Ooh, 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 they, 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 they bite. They bite. Get up, stupid. Sewers? I thought I heard a weeper in there earlier. You're probably the bravest man I've ever met. Overseer um. has arrived. He's with Admiral Havelock now. They want to talk to you. Okay. Where are the chuckleheads now? Corvo. I trust you remember Martin. An overseer before, and perhaps again someday. Soon. Oh yeah. I owe you thanks for my rescue. Indeed, you've given us a glimmer of hope, Corvo, because we've gotten what we wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. Yeah. We know where Emily Caldwin is being held. The Golden Cat of all places, a bathhouse for aristocrats, little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. It appears that Pendleton's own kinsmen stand in our way. Twins, Morgan and Custis. Not only are they controlling Emily, but they have the controlling parliamentary votes we so desperately need. That if I kill them. The Pendletons have to die. But most importantly, Emily must be brought here safely so we can protect her until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. Oh. Pendleton yes. is waiting for you on the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. I think it's best. We're going to the Golden Cat. Sort of. What the? More ore. We're not the back door. There's all kinds of stuff here in there. Hmm. Never been out. This, I guess, is the front door that after they sealed everything off, nobody lives here. 
Huh. I now know the lay of the place a little better. Corvo, a moment if I may. I... Corvo, I've asked to speak to you myself. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. It's true, as you may have heard. Cruel beyond words. Further, my brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent, and as long as they are in Parliament, we cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that not every family evicted in quarantine for having the plague actually has the plague. <laughs> I warned my brothers in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the city watch. So it'll be dangerous. I'll now, kill them all. Please do it before I change my mind. Let's check one more time to see if I have enough coins. I've been picking up a few coins. Corvo, my friend. To buy a few more bolts. Ammunition, weapons, and then we're heading out. Craft something for you. Crossbow bolts. I have seventy four coins. I mean, it's not telling me how many I have. But, uh, yeah. I guess I have to put them in my hand. Hmm, wait a minute. Let me check. Bone charms. Sustained rage and falling star. Ooh. Inventory. Ammo. Yes, I have. I just. Do you remember I bought 20 of these? Now I'm back to nine and seven. Somebody keeps stealing my shit. I keep wasting my uh my money on the buying this shit and then nothing there anymore. So I'm not gonna buy that stuff anymore. We're upgrades only. Upgrades only from now on. Oh, we do have things everywhere. I mean, it's, uh, yeah. And this is worse stuff, right? Map, and another coin, and an autograph. Hello. My name is Samuel. This machine was tossed into the river by the Admiral, but I fetched it. And it appears to be working. But... So this is Samuel's place. I just robbed Samuel. Sorry, Samuel. But I am not giving it back. <sighs> All right, Samuel, we're on our way. I'll take you to the Golden Cat. When you're ready. Golden Cat. Lord the Golden Cat Whorehouse. <laughs> Let's go find Emily. Oh yes. We're figuring this out. As we go, I will not spend any of my money on that crap that they steal. So, I'll just start with whatever I start with and use uh, the money for upgrades. Just upgrades. I'll get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. That's alright. I'll just kill everybody in the way. The, main thing is to the place is going to kill him anyway. Emily. Right? Gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey oh, Factory. Whiskey they factory, sell the huh? elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. Doesn't work so well, does it? And the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. 
I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Thank you, Samuel. You saved me for uh, from a long swim. Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you get near the gambler shook up the moon. Yeah, probably. Chaos. More rats and weepers. What the hell is that? Oh, this ain't gonna be easy at all, is it? Um, yeah, let's use those first. One shot. Now, I'm going to start using Dark Vision a whole lot more. I'm going to have to put that on a key or something. I'm going to have to hot key that thing, but... Uh... Huh? What? What? Huh? Hmm. We gotta go over here. You're right, I can't. What the hell? Are you kidding me? Oh, I'm going to have to do this a whole lot easier than that. Wow. Really? All right, I'm going to have to get snarky with this. Um, Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering. Yeah. Now, now, that's one. So seven and three is my hotkeys for this. Um, no. Eight and three. I want your coins. Give it up. There's no huh. I feel like that's pretty cheaty. Is there a way I can get through here? Attention, uh oh. Anyone with information pertaining to the death of high overseer Nadia Campbell. Uh oh. You are now right, food. Here you are. Come on. Oh, what the hell? Fire breathing? Wow. 
Wow. <clears throat> Let's end the episode here and begin it from the last save because, wow, I'm going to have to really think this out how I want to go. Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one where the watchtowers aren't clever enough. I guess you're getting rid of cameras. Two, three, two and three, okay. So I can go to eight from there. And then I go back to two or three from here. Okay, um, so thank you for coming on a journey with me today. Please leave a like if you enjoyed the video. I encourage you to leave a comment. Constructive criticism is always welcome. And remember to subscribe so you don't miss my next episode. You can also follow me on Twitter for an instant update on all my new videos the moment they come out. The link for Twitter is in the description below. And I'll see you next time.